All right, today we're in Jonesboro, Arkansas, cooking in a KCBS contest. Um, we're using our old Hickory CTO that Steenkill provided for us here last year. It's been a cooking machine. It's won us a lot of money already. Um, what we're doing now is just heating it up, and it's great because it's got this uh, propane ignition on it. You can hook it up to a regular like backyard grill bottle, and then it's got a valve that you turn the gas on. It's also got a burner switch for competition. What we do is we fire it up with this, and then we flip the burner switch on off, and then turn the gas off, and unhook the bottle, and we're ready to go for competitions. We just set our temperature wherever we want it. Right now, we're bringing it up, so I got it about between 250 and 300. I'm just trying to get it hot and get it ready to cook on. But what it is, it's got a firebox down low here, and it's got a basket of coals. And you can hear that jet going back there. It's got a fan with a propane jet on it that just feeds the fire out. It'll have those coals hot and ready. When this dude gets up to temperature, we'll to shut it down and we'll let it run back down about 225, and that's what we cook at. That's pretty much how it operates. Um, I would open it up, but it'll turn it off. When it's got an automatic switch on it, when you open up the door, then it shuts everything down. So you, uh, you don't have to worry about any kind of fires or anything or smoke coming right out of your face. It's also got convection built in it to where you don't have to rotate anything on the racks. The design of it's kind of concave on both sides, kind of like a giant mailbox. And the smoke and the heat just rolls from the front to the back. And that fan pushes it around. That's all that works really good.